Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to solve an interesting Olympiad question that is a raised to the power of log 2a that is equal to 5. Our mission to determine the value of a. So in this video, I am going to find the value of a. Not only that, I will also share a handy trick to help you remember logarithmic values from 1 to 10 effortlessly. So make sure to stay tuned until the end of the video. Let's start this. We have a raised to the power of log 2a that is equal to 5. In order to solve this question, first we need to take log on both sides. Take log a raised to the power of log 2a that is equal to log 5. The LHS, it is in the form of log a power m. In the power, we have log 2a. So log a power m we can write as m log a. So this is the one of the logarithm property. This property says that whatever you have in the power, it comes friend. Log 2a, then log a, that is equal to log 5. In LHS, we have log 2a. It is in the form of log ab. We can write this log a plus log b. LHS is become log 2 plus log a times log a that is equal to log 5. It seems a bit difficult to solve this log 2 plus log a times log a equal to log 5. So that's why let x equal to log a. Then our expression turns into log 2 plus x times x that is equal to log 5. Now expand this x log 2 plus x square minus log 5 that is equal to 0 x power 2 plus x log 2 minus log 5 that is equal to 0. So this is an quadratic equation. We can use quadratic formula here. Now using quadratic formula I am going to find the value of x. So here a value is 1, b value is log 2 and c value is minus log 5. Write the quadratic formula that is minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac by 2a. Substitute these values in this formula. Minus b means log 2 plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac we can call this a discriminant so our discriminant is log 2 whole square minus 4 a is 1 and c is minus log 5 by 2 a is 1 so our x value minus log 2 log 2 whole square minus times minus is plus 4 log 5 by 2 First, we are going to find the discriminant that is log 2 whole square plus 4 log 5. First, we are going to find this. After finding, you substitute again in this formula. Here, log 5 we can write as 10 by 2. 10 by 2 is same as 5 only. Now, it is in the form of log a by b. Log a by b formula is log a minus log b log 10 minus log 2. We know that log 10 value is 1 minus log 2. Now expand this log 2 whole square 4 times 1 is 4 minus 4 times log 2. Now this 4 we can write as 2 square minus this 4 we can write as 2 times 2 then log 2. Now it is in the form of a square this is b square and this is 2 a b. It is in the form of a square plus b square minus 2 a b. The formula is a minus b whole square. This expression we can write as log 2 minus 2 whole square. This is our discriminant. Now this discriminant value substitute in our quartic formula. 
minus log 2 plus or minus square root of discriminant value is log 2 minus 2 whole square by 2. Here we can cancel the square and square root. Then you left minus log 2 plus or minus log 2 minus 2 by 2. So our x values are first we use plus here and here you use minus. Minus log 2 plus log 2 gets cancelled then you are left with minus 2 by 2 which gives minus 1. This is our x value and here minus 2 log 2 plus 2 by 2. After simplifying you will get 1 minus log 2. These are the x values. We assume that x equal to log a. Now these are our x values. Now using these x values now I am going to find the a values. So substitute x equal to log a here. So log a equal to minus 1. In RHS we, we have minus 1. This I can write as minus 1 times 1 is the same as minus 1. We know that log 10 value is 1. So instead of 1 I can use log 10. This is in the form of m log a. So you had to write in this form that is log a power m that is log 10 power minus 1. So log a equal to log 10 power minus 1 we can write as log 1 by 10. So use anti logs on both sides then you will get a equal to 1 over 10. This is our a value. Now going to find another a value using x equal to 1 minus log 2. Log a equal to 1 minus log 2. We know that log 10 value is 1. So instead of 1 I am going to use log 10 and then left minus log 2. So now it is in the form of log a minus b. We can write this log a by b. After cancelling we will get log 5. This is log a equal to log 5. Use anti logs on both sides then a equal to 5. So we found a values a equal 5 and 1 over 10. Having covered the question in detail, now it's time to share a handy trick that will help you when you are working on logarithm problems. Let's start. To easily remember logarithm values from 1 to 10, you can start with known value of log 10 which is 1. Log 10 which is 1. From there, subtracting 0 0.05 from 1 gives the value of log 9 which is 0 0.95 again subtracting 0 0.05 from 0 0.95 which use log 8 which is 0 0.90 again subtracting 0 0.06 from 0 0.90 gives the value of log 7 which is 0.84 again subtracting 0.07 from 0.84 which use the value of log 6 which is 0.77 subtracting 0.08 which use the value of log 5 which is 0.69 after subtracting 0.09 from 0.69 which use the value of log 4 which is 0.60. After that log 1 value we know that log 1 value is 0. From here you just add 0.30 to this log 1 the value 0 you will get log 2 value that is 0 0.30 after that you just add 0 0.17 to 0 0.30 you will get 0 0.47 that is log 3 value this is the trick to remember the logarithm values from 1 to 10 if you found this content helpful please consider subscribing to my channel giving it a thumbs up and leaving your comments in the comment section your support means a lot to me
थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग